Hey guys, it's Kate. Today I will be doing a drugstore product favorite video kind of thing. I was requested a lot to do my favorite drugstore products and so I decided to jump on that and I just have one, two, three, four, seven products from the drugstore here that I really love. Three are face products, two are lip products, oh, four are face products. If you guys would like to see these, then go ahead and just stay tuned for the video. Okay, so the first thing that I have to show you guys is my favorite foundation. I know I've struggled for a long time with what my favorite foundation is, and I have finally found one that works pretty well. Um, in the winter time, I have really dry skin because of the cold climate where I live, and so... Um, <laughs> Wouldn't be a video without me dropping something, would it? So this is just Revlon's Color Stay Foundation, and the color is zero. Oh, whoops, one fifty buff, buff, buff. <laughs> it's for normal to dry skin, and this is Revlon Color Stay, and it literally does last twenty four hours. At least when you set it with a powder, it does. I haven't tried it really without a powder. Maybe I'll do a review on this if you guys would like one. But this is by far my favorite foundation. I've used it for a long time now. And it just really gives you that, um, it can give you a matte finish if you set it with powder, like the powder I'm going to show you. Or it can give you a really dewy finish if you let it, like, go uh, with no powder. So I highly recommend this one for any of you guys looking for a new foundation. And if you haven't found one yet that you like, this is a great one to try. This one retails for about 13 to 15 dollars depending on where you buy it. It has normal to dry options or it has oily to combination I believe and so I always get the normal to dry skin in the winter time and then I get oily to uh, combination in the summer and so it works both ways. The next one that I have also has to do with the face and this is Maybelline's Instant Age Rewind Concealer. This is one that I've seen so many beauty gurus here on YouTube try out. This one is in the color light to pale and I like getting my um, under eye stuff because this is I always put this under eyes and on my eyelids but I always get my highlight shade um, two shades lighter than my foundation basically this just has a little ball on the top a uh, spongy kind of material and you just twist it up and apply it right on under your eyelids and this works so nicely it doesn't crease I've never experienced creasing issues I highly recommend that you guys try this one out if you are looking for a concealer and this one retails for about I think eight dollars okay my next um product is Rimmel London Stay Matte Press Powder and this powder is in the color 011 Creamy Natural and it says up to eight, up to five hours of natural shine control with natural minerals helps minimize the appearance of pores and keeps you matte and those are all 100% true. I put this on in the beginning of my day and when I get home from school it still looks flawless and um, I just put this on with a regular powder brush and it just looks really really nice and I've gone through about five of these so this is a product you need to check out and believe it or not they're like three dollars and for a powder you really can't beat that. My last face product is a CoverGirl Cheek Stir Blush and this is in the color ah natural twinkle and so this has just the littlest bit of shimmer but when you apply it on your cheeks you can't really see it but it's basically this really rosy like mauve undertone and that's why I really like it because it's just really natural and it doesn't look like you're really trying too hard and so yeah this is a great blush and it stays on I don't have any problem with wear um it's just an overall great wholesome blush if you're looking for a blush. Okay, so that was the last face product. I only have one eyes product with me currently, and this is, you guys all know, from, if you watch my tutorials, I'm always using this. It's the Maybelline Rocket Express Volume Mascara, and I have one in waterproof, which I don't necessarily like as much. I feel like the formula is a bit thicker, but this one is non-waterproof, and I use this one every day. You can put as many coats as you want on of this one, and it just doesn't seem to get clumpy. I usually do like three coats. I'm only wearing one coat right now. This one is in the color black, just black. So sometimes you can get, you can get black as black or extreme black, I think. No, I think it's just black as black drop number two. It has a really nice brush. I don't know why it doesn't get clumpy, but if you ever feel like it's getting kind of more of a sticky formula, just dip the wand under water because it's not waterproof, so it'll like mix well with water. Just one time and then put it back in the tube and mix it up and it works like it's brand new. So go get you some of this one. It's really good and I know you'll love it. So 
take my word for it. The last two products that I have to show you guys are some lip products and this first one I got from one of my sisters for Christmas this year and I know it's just been like a little bit of time that I've had this but I've had other colors in this. This one's in the color Just Plum 100 and this is a gorgeous color as you guys can see I'm wearing it right now. So I just put this on over a plum lipstick or sometimes you can just wear it by itself. It looks great both ways and I just like the formula like it stays on but it's not tacky or too sticky um, and it just smells really good too. It smells like vanilla-y flavored um, but yeah this is just a great one and it stays on for a long time but I highly suggest you guys get this one gorgeous colors in this line and think you'll like. Okay, my last lip product is a lipstick from Maybelline and I really only buy my lipsticks from Maybelline I've realized like all my lipsticks are from Maybelline and I think it's just the color payoff has always been really good I like the creamy feel um, but this one is in the shade 450 mauve mania and it's just this color right here and I'll swatch it on the back of my hand for you guys that is how it looks it's just a very natural lip color and um I like it because you can wear it like to school and it's not going to be too bold, it's not going to be too, you know, dramatic or out there. And so that is a lipstick shade I've been using a lot lately and it just gives that nice little, little flesh tone color. Not really flesh tone, kind of. Rosy nude? <laughs> I don't know how you describe this color. So I hope you guys all enjoyed that. Those are just some of my favorite drugstore products. And if you guys would like, I can leave you guys a link for all of those products down in the bar below. All my products I get at Target or Walmart. All these I think were from Target, so they should be at your local Target right now. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed. And if you did, don't forget to like this video. And if you guys have any video suggestions, you can leave them down below in the comments and I will be sure to get to those. All right, see you guys. Bye.